Hey everyone, it's Randy with Coupon Love and Fam, and this was my spending versus saving August 3rd through the 30th. It turned out to be an amazing month. I spent more than I normally would, but there was some fantastic deals on things that I use all the time. Um, I didn't really buy too many things that I would not use unless they were money makers. And yeah, I'm just, I was so excited for this month. It turned out so well. It was a great month to start jumping back into couponing. And um, I would like to make some adjustments, but we'll get to that in just a minute. The, um, I did spend $9 in newspapers this month. My total out of pocket, um, was $152.89. And then I had some $11.87 in returns, which made my out of pocket $141.02. If I had bought everything at full price, I would have spent $1,295.85. So I saved $1,154.83, which is an 89% savings, and I got $30 back um, in different rebates, which would take that up to a 91% savings. Um, I just wanted to see how I did at each individual store. Rite Aid, I pay about $0.43 cents per item. Target, I pay $1.05 per item, but a lot of these were grocery items and they were for my kids, so that's actually a really great price. And Kmart, $0.94 cents each. Walgreens was $0.68 cents each, and CVS was $0.40 cents each. These are how many items I purchased at each store. I obviously purchased the most items at Rite Aid with the eye extravaganza that was pretty much a given. Um, the next was CVS, and then I did buy quite a few items, grocery items at Target. So, um, Rite Aid, I have about a 90% savings. Target, it's only a 44, but that was great for everything that we got to buy, and we're stocked up for a while. And Kmart, 87%. Walgreens was 78%. I won't be going back there. CVS. I have a 93% savings. I still have a $5 Target gift card, $35 in ups, and $10 in extra care bucks. I did earn $60 in gift cards this month. Um, I did have how much I redeemed, but um, I think I left it. No, I redeemed $82.05 in gift cards this month. And I did earn in PayPal um, from everything from Checkout 51 to Saving Star to all of my survey sites that I do, gift hogs, swag books, everything. I um, earned $111.21. So between... My gift cards and what I earned in PayPal, it definitely just pays my out-of-pocket. So great, great month. So excited to see what September has in for us. Kind of slow starting out, but hopefully that'll just gear us up for something even better. So I want to know how much you guys have been saving. If you're doing the spending versus saving with me, what's your favorite store to shop at? And where do you think you're getting the best deals? Because honestly, I think I'm getting the best deals at Rite Aid. But it could have just been the I extravaganza. We'll have to wait and see. We'll compare August spending versus saving with September spending versus saving. Um, the little tweaks that I want to do. I would like to reduce my out-of-pocket to 100 or lower. And I don't think that's going to be an issue at all, considering I did do a ton more shopping this month than I would normally, but with back to school and everything like that, things got a little bit more expensive than normal. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you soon. Bye.